Yeah, I'm so pumped. I wonder who's going to be my next opponent. I wonder when it starts. Oh, <gasps> yeah! oh, my chips were in that pocket. What's up, YouTube? Piercing Pencils here, and we are doing yet another late bloomer action figure review from my action figure collection. And today we have the awesome Diamond Select shirtless version Bruce Lee action figure. He has eight accessories that is a posing base, two sets of nunchucks, a bow staff, and four interchangeable hands two for his right and left hands. He is an amazing, incredible figure. He is one of two versions. As stated before, this is the shirtless version. The other version is the Game of Death tracksuit version, which I will definitely be adding in the near future to my collection. This figure and the other debuted around the fall of 2019. He stands just under seven inches tall, not quite making the seven inches mark, and he has about over 20 points of articulation, which we will definitely be getting into very, very soon. This is an incredible, credible likeness. Diamond Select hits it home once again. Let's get into it. Going into articulation, he has 360 head movement, that much torso movement. Hey, dude. That much shoulder movement. Okay, now going further into this butterfly joint, his butterfly joints are like really, really, really stiff. I'm not exactly sure at this point if it's even a butterfly joint. You can move his shoulder just fine, but do you hear all that resistance and clicking? That's plastic rubbing and grinding plastic like really, really close. And like, I don't know if I should even try to do that. I might pop the arm right off. Back into the articulation, tricep, double jointed elbow, wrist movement, that much torso. He can do a full split, can't kick himself in the butt. He has amazing sock and ankle pivot all over the place. So my closing thoughts on this figure, job well done, Diamond Select. This is amazing. The articulation, though stiff, uh, it's, it's very good. And even in this torso movement, even though it's limited, it's still very workable and doable. Uh, I see I got a little bit more movement than uh, before, but you still can't push him back. These thigh articulations are very, very loose on my figure. Um, I haven't really uh, used it this much, um, but still you can get some posable stances. And here um, it has that unique uh, joints for the uh, pelvic uh, articulation, even though he can't lean back far he can kick himself very very forward almost like he's doing the stretch that he did in return to dragon he like i said he has sock and ankle pivot he has a sock movement here where you can twist it around and he has an amazing ankle pivot it's almost very loose but it's it's quite stiff and he can still stand upright um going into his accessories uh he can at some at sometimes hold all of his staffs and nunchucks but certain ways it's it's not going to grip it it's going to fall right through his hand certain angles it'll stay put and then other you know you know it's it's loose his he doesn't have grip at all in his uh holding hand set these are still amazing accessories uh this is a flexible plastic on his nunchucks as you can see so don't bend them it's not like a a twist tire or anything like that it's just a bendable plastic so that's pretty cool and even with the the fixed position nunchucks with the wind movement on it it's the same deal but this one is fixed in this position and he can hold it but just like all the other it doesn't have any he doesn't have any grip um, so they're they're practically made all the same way and for his left hand still no no grip to where he can hold it in place it's a great, great figure. But once again, I'm glad that I have this in my collection. It's awesome. And getting to his knee articulation, it's not double jointed. It's a single joint. And that's cool. I'm very cool with that. So he definitely makes up uh, in his ankle pivot and his sock pivot. You know, he, he can kick his leg back that far and he can kick it that forward and that's an amazing pose it shows Bruce's flexibility it's awesome 
And this concludes my review for this figure. Do the YouTube things like comment, share, and subscribe.